I come this way far, going back, not knowing anything, but just knowing one thing, the life exists in an incredible fashion, in an incredible ways. And every one of those lives is looking to shape whatever it takes to shape their life. The snow that's fallen has taken the shape of many different ways. And uh, the water takes the shape of everything that goes on there. This is the beauty and the incredible nature of life on this planet and uh, everything around us. If we all have the same conscious level, might be a danger to us all, is it? <laughs> no. We will very gently walk this earth and leave so much more for others to enjoy and appreciate. If you don't bring this attention or the consciousness into the minds and hearts of how this piece of life works and they ignore this piece of life because trying to grab more in grabbing more from the external parts and putting the strain and stress on this life can simply destroy this life and every other life around and more so the life-bearing elements or life-supporting elements that provides life, that is, that is this earth. About 15, 20 minutes ago, I said it will be more snow over those mountains and it was blue, clear sky with sun shining on my face. The words of mine has come proven. It's not because I watch and listen to the weather radio or TV. I don't have any of those. All I have is a sense of connection to this nature and by inference knowing what will be. It's snowing. Got to go because The life continues until such time. It's for me, at least for this journey, till I get to the car, if I did. It's a downhill. <laughs> Look at this art. Can you imagine the art? Not a copycat of this. Nothing's the same. Nothing's the same. Everything. Whew. Anyway, that's what I call a nature and life. Thank you for journeying with me until I get down. See you soon. <laughs>